we have been told to simplify. Now we just need to factorize the numerator, then we check what is common between the numerator and the denominator, and then we cancel. What is important here is to note this one here. It's very important. This one here is a difference of two squares. Now, how do you expand a difference of two squares? If you have a squared minus b squared, and you're told to factorize this one, it is simply a plus b and a minus b. This is how you factorize a difference of two squares. Now, you can now um, expand it now and get this one here. If you expand this one, you get a minus a squared minus b squared. If you are told to factorize, this is how you factorize a difference of two squares. The same is going to happen here. In our case, our a will be equals to 3a and our b will be equals to 4x. Knowing that one, we are going to say now that this one is going to give us uh, 3a squared minus 4x squared. But when you expand this one, you are going to supposed to get this one here. And that is the easiest way and the shortest way to do it. Now this one, if you do this one, you can square, you're going to get, this one is the same as a 9a squared minus, uh, this one will give us 16x squared. So therefore, this one uh, expanded, we get this one here. And that is the simplest way using a difference of two squares to expand in a very easy way. Hence, we are going to have now, when you have this one, this will be 18ax minus, then inside we have 9a squared minus 16x squared. When you simplify or open this bracket, you're going to have 18ax minus 9 a squared plus 16x squared. We can just rearrange this one because we say when an expression has the highest powers 2, it becomes a quadratic expression. Hence, this one can be written as 16x squared plus 18ax minus 9a squared. It is our quadratic expression. How do we factorize a quadratic expression? We look for the product. So the product, the easiest way to do this question, you take 16 times negative 9, you're supposed to get negative 144. Then the sum, in our case, will be, you take the coefficient of ax, which is 18. Then you look for two numbers that when you multiply them, you get negative 144. And when you add them, you get positive 18. These two numbers will be 24 and negative 6. After getting the two numbers, what you just do, come and add ax here and ax here. Replace this positive 18 ax with those two values. You're going to have 16 x squared plus 24 ax minus 6 ax, then minus 9 uh, a squared. Group them into 2 and check what is common. If you look at this one here, uh, we check what is common there. It is 8x. You factor it outside. You're going to have 8x outside. Then you ask yourself, 8x goes into 16x squared. How many times? It will go there, 2x. Plus, 8x goes here how many times? It goes, it goes there, 3a, like that. Then if you come here, you check what is common between negative 6ax and negative 9a squared, you're going to get it is negative uh, 3a, like that. Then you ask yourself, negative 3a goes here how many times? It goes there, 2x, then negative 3a goes to negative 9a squared, how many times? It goes there, positive 3a. You can collect these two now and put them under one bracket. You're going to have 8x minus 3a and uh, 2x plus 3a. 
This is the numerator. We have factors the numerator and we found to be that one there. Now, when you put the denominator here, which is 3a minus 8x, these two look common, but this is positive and this is negative. This is negative and this is positive. We need to make them, uh, in terms of sign, to be the same. What we do, we multiply both the numerator by negative 1 and the denominator by negative 1, like this. When you do so, you only let this negative to affect this bracket and this negative to affect everything in that bracket. You are going to have 8x minus 3a, uh, then this one will be negative 2x minus 3a divided by, this will be now, if you multiply this negative inside, you're going to have 8x minus 3a inside. So you realize that now these two are the same. You can now simply cancel them outside and our final answer will be negative 2x minus 3a 